desire. What makes you itch? What sort of a situation would you like? Let's suppose I do this often in vocational guidance of students. They come to me and say, well, uh, we're getting out of college and we haven't the faintest idea what we want to do. So I always ask the question, what would you like to do if money were no object? What, how would you really enjoy spending your life? Well, it's so amazing as a result of our kind of educational system, crowds of students say, well, we'd like to be painters, we'd like to be poets, we'd like to be writers, but as everybody knows, you can't earn any money that way. Or another person says, well, I'd like to live an out-of-doors life and ride horses. I say, do you want to teach in a riding school? Uh, let's go through with it. What do you want to do? When we finally got down to something which the individual says he really wants to do, I will say to him, you do that and uh, forget the money. Uh, because if you say that getting the money is the most important thing, you will spend your life completely wasting your time. You'll be doing things you don't like doing in order to go on living, that is to go on doing things you don't like doing, which is stupid. Better to have a short life that is full of what you like doing than a long life spent in a miserable way. And after all, if you do really like what you're doing, it doesn't matter what it is, you can eventually turn it, uh, you could eventually become a master of it. The only way to become a master of something is to be really with it. And then you'll be able to get a good fee for whatever it is. So uh, don't, don't worry too much. Uh, that's, uh, everybody's, uh, somebody's interested in everything. And anything you can be interested in, you'll find others in. But it's absolutely stupid to spend your time doing things you don't like in order to go on spending things you don't like and doing things you don't like and to teach your children to follow in the same track. See, what we're doing is we're bringing up children and educating them to live the same sort of lives we're living in order that they may justify themselves and find satisfaction in life by bringing up their children to bring up their children to do the same thing so it's all wretch and no vomit. It never gets there. And so, therefore, it's so important to consider this question, what do I desire? What would you like to do if money were no object? How would you really enjoy spending your life? Hey everybody, Matt Trainer here. I hope you enjoyed that intro. We had a so guys, I'm so pumped up here. I've been watching this nearly every day. Um, sometimes I watch it two, three, four, five times a day. Um, 
Sometimes I watch just this intro part, sometimes I watch this entire thing, and I, as I was just, so I was just watching this on my own, and then I decided to turn on the screen share and share some of that with you, because something really hit me. It's right here. Today is the day. The day you stop worrying about money. And I'm moved to tears here because I'm, I'm looking back at all the times in my life when I worried about money and I'm so blessed to what's happened in the past five and a half weeks of my life. And I want exactly what's happening to me to happen to you. And I've worked my tail off. But it's not been work, guys. <laughs> you know, later in the, it says all that matters is whether you have fun. Guys, I have never been called to do something greater than what I've done in the last six weeks of my life. Never. It's the reason, the purpose I'm here on earth is to lead you and Team Inspire into becoming the greatest team in all of WooCar. And Christian was the fastest VP ever in this company. That's awesome and he deserves it. And I love the guy with my life. I am beyond grateful. And I just talked to him. We talked for a long time because he's just said, we, I love spending time with him. It's just the, the, he's just the coolest guy ever. He deserves that. I believe the kind of team he's created is nothing compared to what a couple of you guys are going to go out and do in the next quarter. I believe there's people here in Team Inspire that you're going to break the records that we just broke in Wukar, and you're going to go not only just break those records, you're going to go change the entire course of humanity just from what we have our hands on here. And my purpose here has nothing to do with the money we've been blessed with in these past five weeks. Guys, my family needed the money we've made. It's great. My wife has countless medical problems. We just got in this crazy car accident. There's so much stuff happening. Like I can't even begin to tell you how much we needed this money, but I don't care about that because I always knew the day would come one day when all the money's going to be there for our selfish, like our personal family needs. None of that stuff matters because the purpose of my life is to love, to enjoy the journey and to inspire, teach and serve others. Why are we called Team Inspire? It's all part of part of my vision for what I believe we're going to do. You, do you guys know how many private messages and phone calls and text messages and emails I've got from people telling me how inspirational things are? And they're, they're, not, they're not just saying, like, oh, Jason, your, your video is so inspirational. I definitely get some of that. I'm talking about, sorry, I got to take these um, headphones off. I'm talking about you guys on the team seeing somebody else and being completely inspired by what that individual is doing on our team. That's what Team Inspire is about. And just, guys, I can see where we're going. And so part of my purpose and my job is to teach and love and inspire you to help you to realize what's in front of us right now. And when I look on the screen here, the day you stop worrying about money, I know some of your stories and I'm not going to publicly share things with your name attached to it, but I know those of you that literally don't know how you're going to get between now and the end of the year, but somehow you found your way in your inside team inspire now. What we're doing here is for you. What we're doing here is for the person that doesn't even know what WooCar is, that you're going to go out and talk to when I'm out in Dubai, or you're going to talk to as we're closing in on Halloween and Thanksgiving, and they're going to have their life transformed where they were ready to take their life because it was so bad. And you're going to be the difference in their life, and you show them a light. <sighs> Do you guys know I was on the phone just a little bit ago? I was on the phone with someone I've known for a lot of years and I asked them, how do they feel about what's been happening here? And they broke down into the tears. I've never heard them cry, even dreamed about it. They broke down into tears from how much this means and how much they realize this is it. 
You got to wake up and realize what's in front of us right now. And if you've been playing small, this is the time to step up and step up into your greatest power because God gave you God gave you gifts that nobody else in the world has. You may not have all my gifts. You have some of my gifts. You may have different gifts that are way better than mine and you got to go use those because that's your purpose and why you were put here on earth. And so I'm on the phone and I listen to this gentleman break down and everything inside of me, I want it for him. He deserves this. And I want it for you because you deserve this. I have one of the busiest days of my entire life. Do you guys know just like two nights before we got in that car wreck, I was getting ready to go to one of my best friends going up. I, w I was getting ready to go to his mom's funeral. This was on Saturday. On Friday night, I stayed up the entire night for the first time in my life. All the way till 7.30 a.m. Working throughout the entire night, cranking stuff for Wukar. And guys, I'm not telling you that so you'd be like, oh, Jason, you're such a great leader. You're so, you're so um, dedicated. Screw that. Who cares what I am? I'm doing all this stuff for you. I'm doing all this stuff so you can be woken up. So you can get out of that crappy job you have. So you can get out of lock that company you feel like you're locked into and you're not getting paid what you deserve. So you can go spend the time with your children and your family. So you can go find the spouse of your dreams. I'm doing it for you to go create those dreams because this is way more than about money. Let's go back even further. Let's forget about talking about money. I know most of you need more money. We all know that. Let's go back to... How would you really enjoy spending your life? And hold on, I so I'm like extremely musically um, inclined and motivated, so I want to hear this with you guys. How would you really enjoy spending your life? To spend your time doing things, bringing up their children. What do I desire? Guys, we're all different people from all over the world, from different walks of life. I don't care if you came in as TLA or team member, none of that crap matters. I want you to go very deep and I want you to think about, because I'm about to be gone and I'm going to give you guys some amazing things I'm going to bust my butt on. And it's so that when I'm gone, you're going to be blessed with some things I've been putting together behind the scenes. You're going to love what's been happening. And again, this isn't about all oh, what I'm doing for you. Forget about that. This is what my purpose is, guys. Do you guys know what it's like to live your life with a purpose? Do you know what it's like? I this this none of this has anything to do with work. So when I tell you I've been working my butt off, more like I've been playing my butt off. I I've never been so inspired to do anything in my life and my entire purpose and the bankruptcy I went through 9 years ago and all the battles and all the struggles and all the stuff I went through my entire life was all in preparation for this right now, for what's happening right now. And I am going to seize this. None of you can stop me from what I'm going to go do in the next couple years. And I'll tell you, it has to do with eight and nine figure type of incomes. And if that scares you, good. That means you've been thinking too small in your life. That's just what I'm going to do. So you can sit there and go watch me or you can jump in and there's going to be some of you that are going to blow away what I can do because I'm nobody special. Do you guys realize we have leaders on the team right now that make my, my teams of 30,000 I've grown make it looks like a little like nothing, kindergarten compared to their PhD. We have amazing leaders in this industry. I can't believe even all these kind of leaders that are now here on Team Inspire in Project Wukar together with us, locking arms, fighting together to get what do you desire. I want you to spend some time on that and really contemplate. I want you to be grateful for everything happening. And I don't care if you go out and build a team right now. And I don't care if you wait for the rotators. I want you to do what your heart's telling you to do. But if the only reason you're not telling friends and family because you're afraid and you're playing small, you're going to regret that for the rest of your life, in my opinion. And I realized that I had no... Guys, I didn't have any plans to talking to any of you five and a half weeks ago. 
when I walked into San Diego that first weekend, you know one of the first things we saw? It was a dark room, like glowing lights all over. It was kind of weird. It's actually really cool. I loved it. But then Matt played the clip I just played for you guys. And he actually played the beginning one of um, like the Darth Vader and all that stuff. That's the intro we saw, both weekends. And so I real quickly realized what I wanted to do. Guys, I sat down and made a video yesterday for my entire family tree on all sides, all my friends and family, uncles, grandparents, cousins, the whole family tree, the entire thing, nieces, nephews. I am going to send a text message later today to every single person I've ever known in my life. And it's going to put a little video that I just shot in my back deck specifically for my blood, for my friends and family. If you guys see that, you're more than welcome to use it. It may not make sense because I'm going to be using last names of people in my family. and They're going to be like, who the heck is he talking about? And who is this Jason guy? Which some people in my family are probably going to say that too. But I'm telling you guys this because for seven and a half years, I haven't talked to any friends and family because I already talked to all of them in the wrong way You know, back in May of 2006 when I started in this industry. And a lot of them were like, you're crazy. Good luck. It's never going to work. It's a scam. Well, you know what? I've been living full-time, six-figure income since 2009, full-time since 2008, and I've spent ridiculous amounts of time with my family because they deserved it. I haven't missed a single school function. I take my kids to school every day. We run. We've become known as the runners. And now I have three kids in school, so now we're four people that run to and from school, from the car at least. We live two miles away, so we, we don't run all the way to school yet. We probably will. But we, we've been branded our entire school. People don't even know my name. They're like, oh, it's the running guy. I went to an, a daughter-father event um, last, um, I don't know, somewhere in the last six months. And um, th there were people there, guys, dads coming up saying like, oh, running guy, what's up? I'm Joe. And I'm like, hey, man, Jason Cardamone. So guys, that's the life I've got to live. I go to their field day because I don't work a normal job. Everything I've done up till now is nothing compared to what I've done in the last five weeks. I, the kind of income, the kind of emotional and spiritual freedom. I thought my life was good six weeks ago and it was. It's beyond great. It's beyond outstanding. It's something I literally didn't even dream I could do. And so what do I desire is for you to be living where I'm at right now. And even beyond this, because what I've realized, this is just the start. I know that in three months from now, I'm going to be looking back and being like, beyond grateful. And I'm so grateful now, I just like cry. I just walk around crying all the time in gratitude. <laughs> so guys, thank you for going on this journey. We have people from all walks of life. I know some of you guys just joined an hour ago. Some of you guys joined a few weeks ago. Some of you have spent dozens of hours some of you are spending, I don't think anybody's spending 130 hours a week like I am. And that's okay. Some of you guys are spending one hour a week. Some of you guys are spending dozens. I know we're all at different stages of this process. And I just want you to know, I am telling everybody I've ever cared about in my entire lifetime, all of my friends and family are going to get that video I shot. And the reality is, they're not going to stop me if every single one of them tells me this is a scam. I'm going to say, God bless you. I understand. You have no idea what you're missing out on. And I explained to them the hundred grand I've put into my bookcase out there and in all everything I've learned, all that stuff all points to this is it. Right here, right now. Right now. There's no tomorrow. You guys know right now, song from Van Han. We should go crank it out with that. We're just going to, you know what? I'm just going to end this with music that's going to tell you guys to go out there and go kick some tail. And that's it. I'm not even going to talk anymore unless I really get pumped up here. I am going to go find a couple things. So I, I love YouTube for this stuff. <laughs> I don't even use like Pandora and stuff anymore. Oh, yeah. So I guys still got to finish watching that video. Um, hold on. So, and hopefully we can get the real video here because the, I think this is it. It's such cool slides they play with this. I'm going to turn my mic down.
All right, guys. I said I wasn't coming back on. Just want to tell you I love you. Get out there right now. Go take control of your life and you go change your entire family tree right now. I love you guys, Team Inspire. You guys inspire me beyond. You inspire me to tears. Love you guys. We'll chat with you guys really soon.